Hello, my hearties, and dinky do it's just me, Scotty McClue. A very, very warm welcome to our TikTok talk show. Fantastic. Lovely to have you with us. And dinky do, I say. Now then, we're just getting everything sorted out for you, so that's amazing. That's just what we like. And uh, we popped up this morning, of course, so you'll see some new TikTok videos in the video side of my TikTok channel. Uh, if you tap the portrait at the top left and follow me, then also you can go and like all the videos now that's rather good isn't it so you can't actually beat that you can't say fairer than that unless you can't pronounce your f's or your th's if you're scrolling through of course stop right here this is the one for you tiktok's top talk show and uh, have a very very nice time coming and joining us you can also pop your comments in i'll read them out to you i'll give you a shout out if you uh, would like a shout out if if there's football on the telly, we obviously don't want to spoil the football's audience because if people know Scotty McClure's on, then they're going to flock to here, aren't they? And they're going to join us live on TikTok. Hello. How are you? Hello, Dinky Do. Lovely to have you with us. And how are you? Do tell us where you're from, of course, and follow me as soon as you come on. Then you can also share the broadcast. So tell 10 to tell 10. Very, very important. Hello, Dinky Do. Lovely to have you with us. And a very warm welcome. Any football on the telly tonight that we know of? Because obviously, Scotty McClure doesn't like to clash. Hello, Scotty from Nottingham. Daniel, we love Nottingham. Fantastic. I used to broadcast to Nottingham, of course. Century 106 Radio. How amazing is that? <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> Don't worry about the cough because we've had it for 21 years. France are playing. Oh, well, that's not so bad. So we probably won't get the French people on tonight. Thank you, Scotty. How are you tonight? Fantastic. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome to Scotty McClure's evening pop-up live on TikTok just for you. Hello, Scotty from Seattle. We love you, Seattle. Am I right in thinking Seattle is a very, very beautiful place? Because I think I'd like to come there. Apparently, it's the home of the media, where the media is king. Is that right? Long live you, sir, from Texas. Bless you, cool cat in Texas. We love you in America. Tremendous stuff. Do come and join us. Now, what have we got here? Daniel, I'm just wondering. Oh, hang on a second. Hold on, I'll just deal with this little troll here. Gone, gone. Fantastic. We love it. Remember, of course, nobody ever trolls Scotty McClure, so they have to go doon the swanny. Who's your favorite author? Well, I'm just wondering, Daniel. I have so many favorite authors. I loved um, Alistair McLean. Yes, Ice Station Zebra, Puppet on a Chain, The Guns of Navarone. Uh, where Eagles Dare, and I love the movies as well, tremendous movies. Hi, hello, me. Lovely to have you with us, or should I say me? Hi, lovely to have me with us. Scotty, do you mind congratulating my friend Aaron? So there we are. I don't mind congratulating your friend Aaron. Uh, apparently, he's coming out as a non-binary transgender. Good stuff. Everybody's welcome on here. All the best from sunny Egypt. Aaron can come on and uh, be himself. Spain are playing. Ah, Spain are playing. Well, maybe not get the Spanish people on tonight, but I don't want to clash with any football games in case the audience plummets at the football and comes and joins Scotty McClure. I mean, let's be honest, what would you rather do? Watch the football or watch Scotty McClure? I think Scotty McClure wins hands down. Fantastic. Follow us as soon as you come on, guys. There we are there. So if you wouldn't mind, Scotty McClure, first lord of the internet, Floatai. Follow me on TikTok at Scotty McClure. Tremendous stuff, okay? Hi from Pete and Ruth and Bridlington. Fantastic. 
Do you enjoy a bit of Matt McGinn? I do. Ireland are playing. Oh, well, we'll maybe not get the Irish on tonight then. Hello, mate. Hello, Craig. How are you? And Dinky Do. Welcome, welcome. As everybody followed, guys, as soon as you see this, follow fest time and uh, go up to the top left hand corner and click the plus sign. Tremendous. And that should take you up. Terrific stuff, Dinky Do. Uh, lovely to have you. With us. Hello, mates, Mr. Craigson. Hello, Craigson. Lovely to have you with us as well, of course. And a big Dinky Do. Uh, Scotland for the Euros. Do you think so, Domis? There we go. It'll be very interesting to see what happens. Everybody's been on asking my opinion. Morocco are playing, says Football Recreation. Ah, oh, well, we'll maybe not get the Moroccans on tonight. Mon the Scotland. Yes, it did. Mon the Scotland. And Mon everybody, actually. Mon to Scotty McClue and get a bit of chat. Set your notifications and say, let me know when Scotty McClue goes live. There's the wonderful Maria Knight. Generous as always. Maria, thank you so much. Now, not too many TikToks tonight. Just a handful to say hi. Do you like Formula One? So there you are, Formula One. Yes, I haven't uh, haven't seen it for a long time. There, I used to love the commentator on that. Loved when Murray was about. Tremendous stuff. Right, 25 beautiful TikToks, Maria. I thank you so much. You're a very, very generous lady. And I hope everything's all right at the bank. Dinky do, Scotty. Simon from the Antarctic Research Scotland. There we are. Hiya, Simon. I hope you're having a fabulous time researching Antarctica. Do you think I'll get the job in an interview for today? If you want it, I'm sure, Jumbo, you will get the job. Hello, guys. How are you all? Karen, lovely to have you with us. And dinky do. How's your day been, Scotty? Says Connor. An excellent day today, Connor. Very, very good indeed. Hello, Scotty. Meet. Hiya, Jamie. Lovely to have you with us. And welcome, welcome, welcome. Can everybody follow, please? I'm not seeing many followers followers and we need to get you on in your thousands yes indeed if you've got a tiktok account you should be following scotty mcclue everyone on tiktok should follow scotty mcclue hello scotty mate you're on early tonight scotty hope you're okay absolutely maria <clears throat> i thought we'd just press on because there was a big available audience so i thought i'll pop up and say hi to everybody which country, is Scotty, has the most time zones spread across the globe? I would think, Robert, we're talking America. There we are. Have they not got half a dozen time zones? You just invited me to watch your live. Karen, how did I do that? Did you get a notification? That is fabulous. Didn't you do me hearties? It's Noah. Noah, we love when you come on. You're very, very popular on here. There we are. Hey, Dinky Doo. Hello, Scotty, says Lenzok. Hi from Russia, says the monkey. We love you in Russia. Private, private. Welcome, welcome to TikTok's top talk show from Russia. Tremendous stuff. Thank you, dude, from the McElroy clan. Yes, Bob. Always lovely to have you with us. Yes, I did. Amazing, Karen. Did I have a time on it? I would like to know when these go out. Hello, Scotty. Well, you'd get it when the broadcast started, I take it. The live stream. Thank you, dude, Scotty. Thank you, dude, Lenzok. Russia has around... 11 time zones. Of course, Kulilio, because it goes halfway around the world, doesn't it? It's actually France, Scotty. They've got African territories, the Caribbean and Antarctic possessions. Robert Stringer, you bring nothing but wisdom to my lives. Thank you so much. The chaps on my shift also say hello. Hello to the chaps on the shift, Lenzok, and Dinky Doo from Scotty McClure, just for you. Hello, big in for the farmer in Port William. We love, is that Port William down in the south of Scotland? We love Port William. It is very, very beautiful. And the people of Port William are very, very beautiful. There we are. What's your thoughts on independence? I say press on. As long as you keep the Queen as head of state. Scotty, Russia is the most time zones. Well, Dermot, 
Robert Scrimger's a very, very clever man, and he tells me it's France. So we shall see, because they've got territories aboard. Could you say, hi in ox gangs? Yes, could you say you run ox gangs? Oh, my goodness, Angus. It's a while since I've run ox gangs. There we go. Fantastic. We do love ox gangs, though, yes. I used to pop into the goodies. Hello from Dumfries, stinky do. Did you know Scotty aspirin was invented in Dundee? Maybe that's because the Dundonians had a sear heat after Winston Churchill was standing for them. Can you recommend anywhere in Scotland? I can recommend everywhere in Scotland. Hello from the Highlands of Scotland. Hello, Camera Hau Taylor. Lovely to have you with us. I can speak Hebrew, Scotty. Think you do? Well, come on, Noah. Give us some nice Hebrew. Bestie, watch your pronouns. Uh, we're all inclusive on here, so you don't have to worry about any of that. Isn't that beautiful? So there we go. Do you watch any footy, Scotty? No, not a single thing. I haven't seen a ball kicked. I'm looking to have a holiday in Scotland, Scotty. So I need some good places. We'll sort your lens off. Yes, don't you worry. <coughs> Lizzie says, could you say happy birthday to me? Yes, Lizzie. A very happy birthday to you and dinky do from Scotty McClue. That's what it's all about. There's the main man himself, Scotty, from Clyde Bank. Oh, Stephen, we love Clyde Bank. Are you a banky by birth, or did you move there for the attractive scenery? Uh, Father John, who have we got here? Uh, thank, you, thank you. How are you, Scotty? There's the wonderful Maria sending me some red roses. Just ten, Maria. No, ten's plenty. There we are. She is such a generous lady. Stop at twenty. Oh, you've got back. Twenty-five, stop now. That's beautiful. Mwah. Thank you, Maria. Thank you. Scotty, you're my favorite TikToker. I love everything you do. Jamie, what a lovely, lovely thing to say. We try to make it the very best for everyone. The best of quality. Follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. Here's the uh, hashtag. First Lord of the Internet. Follow me on TikTok at Scotty McClure. Hashtag Floatoy. Mate, your sound is... A bit funny. Oops, my TikTok crashed. Uh, oh, dear. The only live on TikTok I actually enjoy. La Hoob, you are very, very kind. And I know you and I have our moments, don't we? Just. I wish I could visit Scotland. You can. You can watch TikTok with Scotty McClue, and I'll take you on a Scottish tour sometime. We might go on a live, and I'll take you on a bit of a tour. How about that? Would that be amazing? Thank you. There's some beautiful Hebrew from Noah. Thank you. Here is Hebrew. What are you saying in Hebrew, Noah? Is it very, very polite and complimentary? I love your energy. I thank you, Python. You are very, very kind. Is it the guy off the butt side advert? Yeah, I'd be the cotton. <laughs> no moments today, Scotty. No, no, no moments, La Hoop. We are fine. We're just chilling, enjoying each other's company and enjoying each other's chat and input. You can't beat that. Say hello, Scotty. Dinky do. Hello, Noah. Fantastic. Is the law near Dundee, Scotty, an old volcano? Yes. Yes, I think you do have an old volcano in the day called the law. That Now that's the law. <laughs> there we go. And, of course, another famous volcano is Arthur's Seat. So if you've been up Arthur's Seat in Edinburgh, didn't you do? Scotty, what talk, talk show was you on? I was on the Scotty McClue Nightline, which is 29 years old next week. Is that not amazing? Good evening, Scotty. It's Darren from Nottingham. You always cheer me up with your amazing energy. We love you in Nottingham. Me heart is. Ah, Noah. Scotty, you should make a podcast. Amazing voice you have. Jamie, you're very, very kind. What would the difference be between a podcast and this? Because if you want Scotty on demand, you would just go to the Scotty McClue YouTube channel. Hashtag Floatai, first lord of the internet. What's your perfect cup of coffee? Uh, Coca, my perfect cup of coffee would be no coffee at all. I haven't had coffee for 42 years. 
or is it 41? I can never remember. It's 9.17 p.m. in South Africa. It's uh, 8.17 here. So I would imagine South Africa is the same as Greenwich Mean Time. Does Africa have a movable time zone at all, or is it all on the one meridian? Um, hello, Scotty, I'm new here. It's very nice to be part of your life. Human, you're very, very welcome. We love having top people on the live. Any trolls are immediately toast and they disappear. Have you ever been to Ben Nevis? Yes, I have. Podcast is more something you'd listen to. Yeah, but tell me, I think you could listen to everything on Scotty McClure's YouTube channel. You don't have to watch me. You could just set it going. And I would love somebody to do that, to go to the YouTube channel. You'll see the link just right below my profile there. And um, if you did that, that would be amazing. Not to my knowing, says Python. It's uh, 818 in Ireland. So... You are also on, uh, are you in Dublin? Yes, are you on Dublin time or Belfast time? So if you're in Dublin time, I would think you would be on Greenwich Mean Time, London, Dublin, Paris. No, is that right? Now, who have we got? Scotty, I didn't know you had a YouTube channel. I just found you a couple of weeks ago. Oh, Jamie, Scotty McClure's YouTube channel is the best kept secret in the world. Yes, only those and such as those visit it. And you'll see the link to it right there. Can you see the link beside my profile on my TikTok? Right, you'll see it in black figures and letters. I finished my studies on Martin McGuinness. Learned a lot about the gentleman. Yes, Lahub, a very interesting man. Unfortunately, I would say Martin was also driven in the early days, like so many people, by anger. You know, and that's never a good thing. Never a good thing. So there we are. You have to have a nice, calm, open mind. I love your voice. Imur boy. Thank you so much. Yep, Dublin. So Dublin, you'll be on Greenwich Mean Time, I would think. Hi from Philippines. We love you in the Philippines, Warren. Scotty from the Canadian Rockies. Custom fanfics. Thank you for my beautiful red roses. A lovely gift and well received, I say to you. Scotty, hello from the Canadian Rockies. I've been to Ben Nevis. Beautiful mountain. But listen, tell me this, Jersey. You live in the most beautiful mountain ranges in the world. The Rockies, you know what I mean? Do you like bread? I do, Clown Prince. Yes, indeed. Custom fanfics. Thank you for more beautiful red roses and more beautiful red roses. You are very, very kind, guys. Thank you all for your generosity, for your lovely gifts to Scotty McClue, your TikToks and your red roses and your diamonds and all these things. I have been watching your YouTube channel. I love your argument about the fatties. Well, you see... <coughs> It's politically correct. That's what McClue is always about. I've always been politically correct because I raise the point. I stimulate interest in the subject. Do you remember me? I do, boys, absolutely. Hello from Canada. Basic one, we love you in Canada. Tremendous stuff, fantastic. Yeah, going to watch. I'll see you later, Jimmy. Yep, get on and watch everything in Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. You'll never, ever, ever look back. Nice voice. I thank you, Umar. Uh, could you do a British accent? Oh, my goodness. Whereabouts in Britain? And I'll attempt it. See, Britain's only a landmass, so there's no such thing as a British accent. So it would be Scottish, English, Northern Irish, Welsh, that stuff, Yorkshire. Um, where else? Um, Yorkshire, Manchester, Liverpool. That's sort of idea, you know. What I'm saying, I've subscribed to your YouTube. Thank you, Python. Everybody should subscribe to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel. As I say, it's one of the world's best kept secrets. Thank you for your beautiful red roses. Custom fanfics. I love Scottish people. They're so kind. Lizzie, we do our best. We like to be kind. <coughs> he was driven by anger. Unfortunately, that was inevitable because of what he went through, Scotty. La Hoop. I quite believe it, and I do understand it. I don't think any of us would be any different. You know, things were definitely could have been handled 
better. But there we have it. Uh, you know, do you remember me, Ollie? How could I ever forget you? You're early, Scotty. Is it because the football's on? Yes, absolutely, Glenn. I thought, I'll pop up. I don't want to see any football. There'll be a lot of people who don't. And uh, everybody can come and join me on TikTok. Guys, can you all follow me? I need a follow fest. Uh, there we go. How long should a pint of Guinness be let settle for, Scotty? in your opinion, if you're talking right down in the south of Ireland, I would have said a minimum of 15 minutes. Yes, and I might push that to 20. I've certainly, I have, I have drunk a pint after 15 minutes, but I wouldn't like to go any less than that. But tell me what you think. I'm so happy to have found you, Lizzie. This is so beautiful. We are so happy to have found you. Welcome to Scotty McClure's TikTok Live. I lived in Jersey CI, toured my ancestry in Scotland, and loved the Highlands. Yes, indeed. You gave, you gave, I just gave you a sub. Amazing most recent video. Loved it. Ah, Jimmy, they're all there for you. There's stacks of them on there. And this was huge entertainment. Quarter of a million people per half hour, every half hour, used to listen to Scotty McClure on the radio. It was huge. We RG barged. Uh, unfortunately, the stations are very frightened to put on an RG barge show now. They like to play safe. Thoughts on Kenny Rogers, lovely man, wonderful singer. Hello from Glasgow, thank you do. Guys, you can all sub the Scotty McClure YouTube channel. You'll see the link right there. It's a little gift for all the joy you bring us, Python. You are so beautiful. Thank you so much. Do you live in a town or the countryside? I've lived in both. I've lived in the city. I lived in London, in Queen's Gate, backing on to Hyde Park Gate that I found was where Winston Churchill lived, but not at the same time. What are we putting on the braai tonight, Mr. Scotty? Geodog, my dear, dear friend Geodog from South Africa has been educating Scotty McClue about the braai. So we'll not be putting any rice on the braai because it goes up like petrol. So there, let that be a warning to everybody who's braying tonight in South Africa. Uh, so I think if we put on, what about... A nice wee fillet steak. Could you put a fillet steak on the braai? And could you put baked potato on the braai? What would happen to that? Do tell us, Geodog. And maybe a little bit of chicken. And maybe what about some Scottish square slice sausage? Would that go on the braai? Sheffield, Scotty, we love Sheffield. The Queen's English, says Angela. Yes, indeed, the Queen is four countries. But yes, speaking the Queen's English. Hi, I love you. Thank you. Whoa. Goodbye, Scotty. Goodbye, Lizzie. Have a lovely, lovely evening. Thanks for joining us in Dinky Doo. And fantastic. There we go. And uh, now... Who have we got here? Can you be my grandpa? You're so cool. I thank you. Scotty, I love our little chats. Love the lives. My nanny finds you very interesting. Is that your nanny? 119.5 seconds. But again, it's to settle. Remember the advert. Let the nitrogen rise. 119 seconds. So you're just shy. You're half a second shy of two minutes. Yes, I still, I must confess, I still like it. Hello, Scotty. Good to see you again. Wow, in the majority of pubs in the south, it's poured and served within to four to five minutes maximum. But I agree. La Hoop, absolutely listen. It's whatever suits you. I like it just settled like that. As an old Irishman told me, you see, Scotty, it's also a food. Don't quote me on that. Wow, fantastic stuff. You're very cool, Grandpa Scotty. It should be longer, says Larry. Hi from Edinburgh. Uh, well, I've never had a pint in two minutes. So there you go. Fantastic. 
I usually say I'll just pop out to the shop. Yes, of course, indeed, yourself, yes. Dinky do now, Scotty. England plays Scotland and the Euros will throw us in them. When do they do this, Glenn, so we don't clash and bring all the audience to Scotty McClue and it means nobody's watching the football? You can let it settle for as long as you need. Uh, so there were 190.5 to pour. Either draft can about all right, Robert. I've got you. I'll have a nice, cool... Oh, we're advertising now, James. Yes, indeed. Hi, Scotty from Edinburgh. How are you, Sean? I am outstanding, and we love you in Edinburgh. And dinky-doo. Free Israel. Yes, and free Palestine. There we go. A bit of balance for you. Absolutely, guys. Are you ready to meet reality, Death Hosan? Death is nothing at all. I will only be in the next room. So there we are. Hello, Scotty. How are you today? What's up, Hillbilly? Hey, Hillbilly. Was the last time you had an iron brew? I very nearly had one at lunchtime today. <coughs> An ice creamy pint of stout, and you wouldn't need your dinner at all, Scotty. Uh, well, no, you'd think you wouldn't. <laughs> you think I'll just have another one of them instead. Thoughts on Lord Lucan? Well, Lord Lucan has officially, as far as I know, been declared dead, the one that, uh, that disappeared, and uh, his heir and successor will now have the title. We also have a dish called putschi food. It's cooking food in a small iron cauldron over a slow fire. And what would you pop into that, pray tell, my good friend, Geodog? Yes, if you can spill the beans, if you'll pardon the pun. <laughs> All you need in life. Yes, of course. Good evening from Sheffield in England. How can I be as happy as you? Uh, you get on and watch Scott and Clear TikTok and see all these beautiful people who are coming on. They will make you happy. <laughs> Tremendous. Just sent 3,200 likes. Susie, baby, what are you like? You're such a beautiful lady. Mwah! Hi to Rachel Dinky Doo, Rachel Dinky Doo. All you need is right, right down the hoop there to stay. Scotty, the Euros goes on for a month from Friday the 11th of June until the 11th of July. Oh, for goodness sake. Well, we'll have to. It's either going to be football or Scotty McClue. Most people will choose Scotty McClue. Do you still think God Save the Queen would survive in an independent Scotland? Scotland? I think so, Robert. Yes, because it is the national anthem. Although the wonderful Roy Williamson, um, an OG, an old Gordon Stonian, wrote Flower of Scotland. Good morning, Scotty. It's been a while. Cheers from Australia. You see, if I can tell you, in the Scottish regiments after Culloden, they were obviously serving the Queen, so they toasted the Queen. And then there was a Gallic toast to the King over the water. Isn't that interesting? Now then, follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. There's only one thing we say to death, and not today, please. Thank you very much. Uh, so there we are. This is so beautiful, says General Success Grant. Shall we have a tea party, my good sir? Yes, we shall, mon general. Excellent stuff. Boston Harbor is a good place for that. Indeed, yes, dress up of North American Native Indians. I said to a lady, I will teach you to speak North American Native Indian in three weeks. She said to me, how? I said, you see, you're picking it up already. Hello from the USA. We love the USA. You say congrats to my friend Frankie. So there we are. Yes, we can. Winter started in South Africa, right, Python? So here's what I've always had as a dream. I work in the UK or in Scotland for six months of the year. The other six months of the year, I come to South Africa or to Australia or New Zealand. What do you think? Is the Tay Bridge the longest rail bridge in the world? The Tay Bridge, the longest rail bridge. Is the fourth not longer than the Tay? I couldn't tell you, Robert, for sure. Do you know the rest and be thankful? Which one, the old one or the new one? 
My parents used to take the old one. It's known as the old military road. It's been used a lot because of the landslips. And my parents used to take that one because at the top, you rested and were thankful. It was quite a journey. It's basically anything you fancy. We normally layer veggies with meat briquettes and let it simmer. So you're talking about a kind of a stew geodog, like an Irish stew. There we are. Maria, the lovely, lovely Maria Knight has sent me a beautiful finger heart. Maria, you're such an angel. Bless you and thank you. Yes. Can you say hello there for a video? Hello there. <laughs> Hi from Ireland. Does Scotland ever have a royal family? What are you talking about? The royal family is Scottish. Scotland's had a royal family for 2,347 years. And in 1603, Scotland took over the English crown called the Union of the Crowns. So the royal family are Scottish. Hence the reason Her Majesty the Queen, who's 50% uh, Scots, uh, her sister was born in Scotland, and her mother was 100% Scots. And she was married to a gentleman who was educated in Scotland, and their titles are the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh. What about that? So there you are. So Scotland, the royal family is Scottish, but we also have taken over the English crown. Scotty, uh, then it's the Olympics. Both these events are delayed from last year due to COVID. Ah, well, in that case, I think the Olympics might suffer from everybody watching Scotty McClue live on TikTok as well. You know, how come I can't see the comments you're reading right away? I don't know. Guys, can you all see the comments? And if so, how do you see them? Dinky news, says the Irish gent. Wish me luck in my rugby game tomorrow. Adam, I wish you luck in your rugby game tomorrow. What position are you playing? The old one in Scotland. What's your opinion about Scotland's independence? You I'm, guess I'm actually economically, Scotland would do very well as an independent country. And it's had the economic life sucked out of it by Westminster over the last 313 years. And uh, we're now subsidizing Westminster to the tune of 75 billion pounds a year. So I think Scotland needs to hang on to its own money. That's really what we're after. So never mind all the rest of the trimmings. Yes, Scotland and a royal family, the old house of Stuart. Yes, and Prince Charles has got Stuart blood in his bloodlines. Is that not beautiful? Yes, sir, very much like a stew, like a hot pot, geodog. How lovely. Uh, you put in gobbles of meat. See, people think it's rude when you tell somebody to shut their gob, but uh, you're just telling them to shut their meat hole because you would cut meat into a gobble and then you would cook it and you would shove that in your in your mouth in your gob all right ah oh, jesus lad i'm sure i know you there you are oh, do you not just well away now uh, ah good irish stew a bit of guinness mixed in it's amazing stare naughty boy shame they treat scotland with such contempt they do but they shouldn't i think they are very worried that if scotland leaves things will be very tight in westminster and they've just frittered 200 billion pounds on Brexit for no reason. Where are you from, dude? I am from Scotland, dude. And I love you from all over the world. Dinky do, Scotty, from Lerwick. Big Viking. How lovely to have you with us. Now, you didn't have up Helia this year, but you're going to be having it next year. Am I correct or am I just right? Do tell us. We love you in Lerwick. Do you know Lerwick Gal and Lerwick Guy who have just given birth? Well, Lerwick Gal has, um, uh, you know, assisted by Lerwick Guy of Little uh, little Ellie. There we are. Tremendous stuff. Uh, she's not technically the Duchess of Edinburgh now, Scotty. Sadly, after Philip's passing, no, no, she would keep the title. Uh, so as she would be the Dowager Duchess of Edinburgh if the title has been handed on. Yeah, there was some talk of it. I'm not sure what happened there, Robert. But she would still be, uh, she would just be known as the Dowager of the Dowager Duchess of Edinburgh. Who was that lady? That's the Dowager Duchess of Edinburgh.
There we are, fantastic. Like we have the Dowager Duchess of Argyle, Iona, who was uh, Iona Cahoon from Luss. Fantastic. From Ross Du House in Luss. Maria has just showered me with the most beautiful hearts. Thank you, Maria. So there we are. Can you say congrats to my friend Charlie? He's just won the Fortnite World Cup. Good evening, says Kenneth in the know. Good evening, Kenneth. Hello, Scotty. How are you doing, my man? Well said, says CDW. Oi, Scotty, what the heck's happened to your life? What's wrong with it, Welsh? There, there we are. We're on. Is it all right? Is it sounding okay? It's on my bucket list to play golf in Scotland. Denny, you would love it. Have you ever seen Robin Williams talking about a Scotsman uh, inventing golf? Hey. Hello from Oklahoma, my Scottish friend. We love you, GM on from Oklahoma, where the wind comes sweeping down the plain and the waving wheat does sure smell sweet as the wind comes right behind the rain. Watch your pronouns. We don't do any of that band because we're all inclusive. Another 2,000 likes, Scotty. See if I can do 10,000. Susie, baby, you're just so kind. You're a lovely person, and it's so thoughtful and appreciated. Scotty, do you like haggis? Scotty, flow tie. I read that book you recommended, and OMG, I cried. Which one was that, Welsh? Remind me which one we were talking about. Good evening, Scotty. Hello from Texas. How are you all doing? Hey, say, buddy in Texas. We love you guys. You're big, tough, rough guys, and you're fabulous. Hello from London. We love you in London. Fantastic. Now, what do we got here? Watched even more YouTube videos. They're amazing. Jamie, it's, I'm telling you, it's the world's best kept secret. How there's not a million people on that YouTube channel. I wonder if I've not ticked some little tick box or something that makes it go public. You know, because guys, all get on to Scotty McLeod's YouTube channel and subscribe. Let me know you've subbed. You will love it. There's 1,400 videos. <coughs> Maria has sent me a jet plane, Maria. You are so generous. What do you think of the Irish? I adore every single one of them. Yes, indeed. The calls for independence come from more of a socialist intent than wanting self-determination. Yes, Dean, that's slightly worrying because, you know, to be too far one way or the other is never good. And one or two of them are a bit sticky about the royal family. Now, uh, you shouldn't get caught up with the actual personalities because the monarch is the curator and custodian of the crown, which is our symbol of authority. You see, in the same way that in Ireland it would be a flag, the tricolor, in America it would be the stars and stripes, and in Scotland it is the crown, the old Scottish crown. Fantastic stuff. There we are. Do you know Bill? I don't know Bill Geodog. <clears throat> Someone just sent you a hundred pounds. I don't think so, Shane. It would have come up, wouldn't it? if they'd sent me a hundred pounds. Thank you, do, Scotty. Although the wonderful Maria has uh, popped money into paypal.me forward slash Scotty McClue before. And uh, she's a very, very generous lady. Thank you, do, Scotty. What are them books behind you? Them books, Lens Hawk, are part of the library at McClue Towers. Scotty, my battery's on 10%. Oh, Glenn, be careful. I'm on 100% here. I'll share some of my power with you. Thank you, do. I'll send you... My power. I love that Robin Williams joke. It's so, Robin Williams, I'm heartbroken. I love that man. He was just so talented. Gorgeous, gorgeous guy. What a shame. There we are. What brand is your wig? Uh, well, the police said to me, has your hat been checked? <laughs> we love it. Come on, says Angela. The story about the wolf and the baby or oh, Welsh. Gellert. It's heartbreaking. So beautiful. Bless Gellert and bless his beautiful heart. Scotty, do you have a tablet or a laptop? I've got a tablet and a laptop. Uh, but they're not... Uh, uh, the, the tablet's okay, um, although the camera's not great. 
but the laptop is a little bit slow, even although I added a few more RAM of MEM. See what I just did there? Are you impressed? You know, my time of life, RAM, MEM, all that stuff. Texas has become more of a new California. We need to get out there and see you all in Texas. How are you doing? Football, dinky do. Do you like the parachute regiment? Sorry if it's a touchy subject. No, not. There are no touchy subjects on here, Tank Man, especially when you've asked, especially my father was a para. So there we are, six years, Second World War, dropped into all sorts of places. Market Garden, Nijmegen, uh, defending the bridge at Nijmegen, Norway, to support uh, the far-right skinhead movement. No, no, just because people are bald is the skinheads have gone. I don't support anything far anything. I am apolitical. A big thinker. I see the big picture. Hello from West Sussex, lad. Thank you, dude. Scotty, I think you've mellowed since your radio days. Not at all, Glenn. Still the same. How many islands make up Scotland, do you know? Robert, give me a second. <coughs> and I'll see if I can get you a rough total. I would say 150. How about that? You say congrats to my friends, Alex. He's just reached 70K on YouTube. Red Bull, of course I can. There we are. Built on large slats of salt and spice laced meat. Wind and sun dried. Very South African. So is it like a big jerky, if you'll pardon the expression. Right, so it's like a big form of jerky geodog. Thank you for that. You're a top man. Since I've become more amenable to Scottish independence, I've had to defend the monarchy more. Oh, we're taking the monarchy with us. Don't worry. If any of these so-called nationalists think that they're not having the Queen as their head of state, they can think again. And anybody that didn't take the oath of allegiance properly should either do it or stand down. I like your cut, G. Julian, I like your sir. There we are. That's fine, though. Just educating people. It's people's choice. We live in a free society. Robert, of course we do. And uh, the freer, the better. And we need to be live on TikTok, the last bastion of freedom. I've heard you somewhere, I swear, Sharif. You will have. I've been on the, on the radio with the Nightline for 29 years next week. Robin Williams was a legend. We loved that man. Do you support far right? No, we don't. We don't do any of that nonsense. Hey, man, I'm new to your account, Manchester. Come and join us. I'm not new to Manchester. Ask anybody about Scotty McClure. Uh, 20 years ago, uh, do you remember John Laurie from Dad's Army? Of course I do, Angela. John Laurie was from Dumfries. There you are. He used to act at the Theatre Royal in the face. Yes, pretty much like American jerky, but thicker and more slab-like. What's your opinion about Israel, how about Palestine? Dean, I want them both to sort themselves out. Get sort of stop chucking ordnance at each other. Ireland and Scotland, Celtic brothers, can you give us a joke? <coughs> a joke, Shakarani. You want me to give you a joke? Uh, what could I tell you as a joke? Um, I don't like people that finish spelling my words. Somebody asked me to spell Luke. I said, hello. They went, okay. See what I just did there. Hello from Norway. No way. How fantastic. Vietnam, we love you. So there we are. Did you escape that case? So there we are. Alfie, stop trolling. And uh, we'll have to give you a lifetime ban for trolling. That's the kind of thing you see on other lives, not on Scotty McClure. There we are. Uh, dried fish is an acquired taste, very rough on the palate. Ah, dear dog, yes, I know what you mean. I've never actually tried it. I've heard of it, though. So there we are. Talking about freedom, people are more inclined to be taken care of than being free. Uh, well, do you know, you're absolutely right, Dean. <coughs> you see, somebody said that one of the reasons that the slaves were freed was uh, not just moral, but it was economically uh, better for the slave owners to let everybody go. So I see what you mean. 
There we are, Scotty, back on charge. One out of a hundred for the joke. All right, Blue Math, no problem at all. I threw away my old vacuum cleaner the other day, I said. See you, soccer. It's always been free for Scottish students to attend university. Well, you got a grant, Robert. So I actually got a grant. There was no student loans when I went in 1977. So there you are. Fantastic. Can we have an update on your bush? Yes, Shakaroni, there will be an update very soon because Big Roddy has come out even more. So we'll be telling you, guys, make sure you follow every single one of Scotty McClure's TikTok videos. What's your political stance? My political stance is apolitical. There we are, Rangers or Celtic. And my advice, Liam, would be go and see them both play and follow the best one. Yes. Uh, now, who have we got here? Uh, can you shout for a real one? There you are. Follow us, guys. As soon as you come on, look, look, look. Here we go. This is for you. Fantastic. It's going to clear. False Lord of the Internet. Follow us as soon as you possibly can. And dinky do, I say. That's what we want. <clears throat> Did you watch the golf? I don't watch the golf, NJ. Scotty, keep an eye on the Euros when Scotland play England. Who's your allegiances to? Well, Glenn, of course, they'd be very, very split, wouldn't they? You know, may the best team win. Santa, says Smarto. Lol, 97 and a half, Blue Math. I knew I would get back in the good books, Blue Math. Fantastic. There we are, Dinky Do. Fantastic. Follow us as soon as you possibly can. There was a guy up in court for thinking it was a firework, Blue Math. The judge let him off. See what I just did there. Scotty McClure is the undisputed floati. Shakaroni hashtag F-L-O-T-I uppercase. Another 3.7K likes, wicked man. You're a legend. Susie, babe, you are the legend. I am nothing without you beautiful people. You are so lovely to me. And uh, I love the fact that the lives just took off. Amazing. Follow us as soon as you possibly can, guys. Scottish universities were the best. England used to send their nobles there. What happened? Well, what happened, Dean Winchester? All the Scottish universities are older. Well, sorry. Uh, Edinburgh, St. Andrews, Glasgow, and uh, Aberdeen are probably all older than England's universities. England only had two universities when Scotland had four, you see? And top Scots, if you go to Oxford, there's a college called Balliol, called after John Balliol. And if you go to Oxford, there's Oriel, or Oriel, Oriel College, Oxford. Again, another Scottish college. And John Buchan, who went on to be Governor General of Canada, Lord Tweedsmuir, John Buchan went to Brasenose. So there you are, Brasenose College. <clears throat> I've quit my job at the Refuse Centre, Scotty. I was down in the dumps. Ah, Robert. Ooh, a knee slapper. There we are, fantastic. Good one, Scotty McClure. Josh jinky -doo. My kids love you, Scotty. I thank you, Paul. Fantastic. You're slipping again. Not at all, Blue Math. That was a goodie. So there we are. Good evening. It's Lerwick Gall here. Mr. Lerwick is with Baba. Lerwick Gall, I've just told Big Viking from Lerwick the news. Yes, it's Ellie. Isn't it? Did I get that right? Illy. Scotty, there'll be some atmosphere at Wembley when England plays Scotland. Less capacity. Indeed, yes, and we'll have to keep our distance. So there we go. Can you tell Matthew to skip golf and go swimming? Okay, Joe, I shall tell him. Matthew, you have to skip golf and go swimming. Mama says, uh, what's your pronouns, love? You don't need to worry about any of that on here. We're all inclusive. So you're very welcome. Do you support communism or socialism? Well, I think they're kind of similar. They're a wee bit to the left. 
but uh, I think we need more of a balance. I don't think we want a far right or a far left. We don't need any of that. Now, there we go. Christian, you're spamming me now. I think you're a troll. So I'll send you down the swanee, Christians down the swanee. I want to say thank you so much for your good wishes yesterday. Larry Gall, yes, indeed. An absolute privilege and a pleasure. We all want to thank you for sharing the good news. Because as you know, Scotty McClure's TikTok channel is all about good news. There we are. Scotty, lower capacity because of the social distancing. Best to have fans there. Do you think so, Glenn? Do you remember Ronnie Corbett from the Two Ronnies? It was Ronnie Corbett, Angela, from the Two Ronnies. Wonderful. He was a Scotsman from Edinburgh originally, I think, if I remember right. Your knowledge is outstanding, Scotty. Josh, bless you. John Buchan, Lord Tweedsmuir, was buried in London on the same day as an IRA bomb. Am I right, Robert Scrimger? You're 100% right. The IRA set off a bomb in, was it June 1940, the same day as Lord Tweedsmuir's funeral, totally unconnected, of course, because John Buchan, being a Scotsman, was very, very popular. There you are, but you're 100% correct, Robert. Absolutely. Yes, indeed. Uh, who have we got here? Are we lads called Ella? Are we lass? It's called Ella. There we are. So I wasn't too far away then. Larry Gall, I thank you. Even my friends who hate football will still watch Scotland England's been gone since 1872. But Robert, yes, I don't want them to clash with Scotty McClure's TikTok. I don't want football to lose its audience just because I happen to have popped up random on TikTok. Do you know what I mean? What about a knock knock joke? Last chance to redeem yourself. Okay, Blue Math. Here's a great knock knock joke. You start. Who's there? Larry Gal, sorry, lass, absolutely. I, I'm Sophia from the Philippines. How are you, Sophia? We love you from the Philippines. We welcome and welcome you to Scotty McClue's Live on TikTok. This is the big one, the one everyone's talking about, the one everyone's watching. Guys, like every single one of the videos. Can I have some follows, please? If you haven't followed me, be very, very ashamed of yourself. Yes. Follow me on TikTok. Scotty McClure, float eye. First lord of the internet. Scotty lad, thank you do. Yes, indeed, I thank you. Scotty, nice to see you again. It's been a good while. Long John. Don't leave it so long next time, naughty boy. Scotty, it's good night from me and good night from you. I know I need to dash. Dinky do. Bless you, Scotty. You're the unsung hero of this splendid app. You continue to surprise me. Josh, it is such a fantastic app. We love TikTok and everybody loves the Scotty McClure lives. And I say thank you, so please share them. Scotty, more jokes, more jokes. Scotty, I hear Big Roddy has grown. He's grown and he's come out. And he's come out even further. Scotty, looking forward to the Euros. You'll be rooting for Scotland. Long John, bit of a moot point that. Scotty, I heard you did something. Uh, I don't know what that is. Right there, something about having my CV. <laughs> Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Right, there we go. Scotty, can I be the second lord of the internet? I'm sure, Len. I don't know if it's taken. What was the first search engine? So there we are. The first search engine would be a fire engine. Edinburgh, the oldest fire service, fire and search and rescue. Scotty, buddy, how are you? Can you call Huggies? A chunky fella, Zach. Why not? Follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. I'm going to have to dash soon, though, I have to say. How will Scotland do against the Czech Republic? Listen, Owen, if I could tell you that, there'd be no need to watch the game. You know what I mean? Who invented tanks? Uh, well, I'll tell you, there was Little Willy and Big Willy, and they were the names of the tanks. And the man that signed them off for the army was, uh, was it Sir Edward Ellis, check up, check up the name E-L-L-E-S, and uh, you'll find that that's tied up with the tanks. So there we are. But the Scots would have invented them. I think he probably commissioned them for the army.
His father was the go-between in India. Uh, Lieutenant General Ellis was the go-between between, between Kitchener.